So you called Dad? I thought I owed him an explanation at least, so we talked. Are you OK? Not really. It was pretty full on. You said that I'm worse than Maya, that I'm abusing you and you can do better. I know he's upset, but that's just evil. He's angry and upset. He trusted us both. He loved us and we've betrayed him. Yeah, only because we didn't want all this. He thought me and him would end up together. He told you I was the love of his life. Just the idea of you and me together is killing him. He's broken, Jacob. And I hate what we've done to him. Just as much as you do, but we can't help the way we feel about each other. We should have told him. Right from the start. Yeah, you're right. Yes, it'd have struggled. But at least then he would have known we respected him enough to tell him the truth. All these lies, it's just made things a million times worse. So there's no way he will ever come round to you and me. And when Layla finds out... You don't know she'll kick off. She's always said she wants me to be happy. Yeah, with anyone but me. She wanted you to go to uni so you could get out there and live your life. And instead, you've ended up sleeping with your dad's ex who flips burgers for a living. You know I don't see you like that. I'm sorry, Jacob, but this has to be as far as we go together. No. Vic. I have had the best time with you. You're a wonderful, gorgeous person, but relationships, they fail. Family, if you've got one, that's everything. And I'm not going to let you throw yours away. Don't do this, please. I lost my mum years ago, and then Dad. And I still miss him so much. It's lonely being on your own. So I'm not going to let that happen to you. You love David. And deep down, you know that he still loves you. If we end this, and you go and you tell him how much you really care about him, then there's still a chance for the two of you. I am really, really sorry, Jacob. But this has to be over.